What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying with the goddamn hair, your league. So, apparently, um, Krishan went live twice today. Uh, I don't know if she spoke about Blueface's arrest or whatever, but people have, they telling me to react to it. So, that's what we about to do. You dig? Let's get it. Slide with you. I like that, but, bro, if I'm going to court, life on the line. Man, you, over there because yes he did i only went to pa because glo was like yeah come to the beach go like yeah come to the beach i'll come to the beach go like yeah we're going to the rehearsal i'm like i'm coming and she's like yeah i'm ready to do this show uh all right you want to come on stage with me oh you blocked me ain't gonna book your flight i booked my flight i'm like bitch i'm coming okay sure then make some money on the side of that Okay. Like, this band in PA. I'm like, God, right, cool. Then I'm like, oh, PA to New York. All right, I'm going to New York. I'm just, cause like one thing about when you're going through a toxic breakup, you have to stay busy. You have to stay busy, bro. So. That's a fact. She ain't told no lie. Hi, double twins, double those twins. He took a person phone that don't um, sound right. You just got it would if he were to be, um, not robbing per se, but like whoop his ass, be like, nigga, I'll take your phone. I stay busy. So it was just like, I was going with the flow with the Lord. And then he called and texted me and was like, what'd he say? I'm ready to go out of town for court. And I'm like, oh, oh, shit. I'm in New York. I'm ready to take the jet to Miami, but I won't go to Miami. I come to court. That was my plan because, like I said, my nigga. I don't know. So she trying to go I to the court. I actually love bro unconditionally. Would I get back with him? Hell no. Good. Hell no. Okay. I like this. So will I get back with him? Hell no. I like but that. Is he my friend? And I love him? And the kid of my father? Yes. Not the kid of my father. I mean, my kid, my father and my kid? Yes. Yeah, I love him. He's cool. <laughs> but the other shit, I gotta really glow up. You feel me? This is time for when Krishan just glow up. That's a fact. Get on her shit. That's a fact. And then really fight the world with all these. Beautiful black woman, women in, in general, but black women. I like how we stick in that guy with a real for real. Facts. Y'all all, oh, you're loving on me and shit. You fucking with it. Like, what? Shout out to, I, I can name a hella names. Everybody just loving on me for real, and I'm just like appreciative and, you know. That's good to know. The attempted robbery is crazy, but that's good to know. You know, black women got to stick together. Who else? Who else going to do it? But I'm just glad I didn't, I didn't fly back home. I went from New York. I'm going, like, I'm on my way to Miami right now. Stop dropping your alone. Get the fuck off the line. Word. All right, PD. Cause I got business to take care of. He absolutely right. Hello, get the fuck off the line. That's the type of friend you need, or brother. But I'm covered like by the bread of Jesus. What about my tattoos? Um. That's why we going to Miami to get the bitches removed. I mean, it's a possible I get it removed. 
Or just drag, my nigga. I'm that nigga. I don't really like changing shit about me. Like, when everybody was like, get your tooth fixed, I tried it. It don't stay in. So I'm just going to be cute sometimes when I feel like it. <laughs> Not cute sometimes when I feel like it. I'm telling you, behind closed doors. I know. I'm trying to think. I know. I could have told you that. Shit was happening, right? And it didn't look like it was going to go in my favor only because I don't. I don't know, bro. You just. My thing is, I never want to be up against a guy. Like a nigga. Like when you're up against a man. And then they get salty about something. Oh, oh, God, good luck. Good luck, sis. Good luck, sis. Good luck. Because when I made one direction in my favor, and it was, like, responsible, not, like, selfish. It was responsible, and this is what we're going to do because we have to start thinking about Krishan and Krishan and her baby. Like... I'm telling you, all hell broke loose, bro. <laughs> so, this breakup, not only it just was annoying, it was very, like, evil shit just started happening. I'm going to just be honest. And then it didn't look good for me only because that person is just what he wanted to be at that time. So... I'm just like, whatever. And then I gave the fight, like the fight of what I felt like I had to fight for, I gave it all to God. Like, God, look, I'm just going to go on the road. I'm going to go on this stage to stage. I'm going to pick up this check to check, city to city, jet to jet, and yeah. then keep it pushing. But I'm telling you, while I'm saying that to myself, bro, shit was happening, and it was so detrimental. Like, I'm like, damn, all this positive shit going on. But, but. I don't think it's detrimental to like be at Summer Jam with Glow and Cardi and Erica Badu taking up for you. And like, nah, I'm playing. I don't know what was detrimental. You you don't know what anyone's detriments is. And I'm not being funny, but it's like, what was so bad? You the hell away from that nigga. Oh my God. You're so away from him. I thought that was the goal. Right, it was so bad, right? And I kept I kept asking God, like, is this fair? Can he say that? Can he do that? Oh my god, he really right. But it was a it, it had nothing to do with other people who've been involved. It was the things that like I had my guard down because he's my man. Well he was, whatever. A guy a guy that I love and supported, vice versa. So I trusted him with a lot of things that shouldn't have been trusted with. And it put me in a position to be like, damn, I really gotta say, fuck, I don't wanna say everything because it's a lot to say. And it's a lot of money to be saying about. But <laughs> long story short, it was looking like I would had to go up against something and, not, and it wasn't my fight. Like, I don't deserve that type of shit on some real shit. And me, y'all tell me what the fuck she talking about, cause I don't, I don't know at this point. I'm not no type press. I'm not money press. I'm not. I don't want child support. I don't even need you. You gotta have money to right now to help me provide for my kids. That's not the case. It's just the fact that I had to go through some shit to see like, oh. She gotta really be talking like about her money. Evil as fuck. But I love him. He just he got too evil for me. You know, people don't really care about shit until that money situation. And I think maybe she was looking at it all wrong, or like she got to getting around Glow, and Glow was telling her how much was in her bank account type shit. <laughs> Cardi B was telling her how much was in her bank account type shit. And then she like, well, 
I'm about like a million and some change and several million short. You know what I'm saying? Like, what's going on, bruh? And then she probably asked that nigga, like, what's up? And that nigga probably was like, yeah, bitch, I, I spent it all, nigga. You ain't getting nothing. What money? Somebody, a, a guy did that to me before. He Rest in peace. He's, he's no longer with us, but um, he did that to me before. Fell out with him, and his girl had paid for something for me. I had to pay her back. So I gave it to him. And I said, uh, you know, make sure you give it to her. And he was like, what money, nigga? I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> now it's somebody out there thinking, I ain't want to get her that money, girl, and he done took it. I ain't going to lie. And now she ain't going to ever get it back. Yeah, but it wasn't, like, when it got out of hand, I knew it wasn't my fight, bro. I just started getting busy, kicked back, and I, I'm not chasing after nothing, but the money that's chasing after me, and then ties and off with But I'm saying, like, he was thinking I wanted to do a pissing contest with him, and I wasn't. I was just really trying to do what was right and what was responsible on my behalf because of what I earned and what I deserved. But in his eyes, and it went left. Like, as soon as I got to pulling up receipts, numbers, and shit, See? this nigga start pulling up shit that don't add up and start doing shit. See? I know she was like, I know I, know I ain't the... <laughs> You know, I may not know it all, nigga. And, and don't get me wrong. Nah, I ain't. No disrespect. You know what I'm saying? I don't, don't want to fight. But uh, it says here that I made about $5 million last year. And um, right now I got 50 k in my fucking pocketbook. I'm just, I'm trying to figure out where's my money <laughs> so since it's like that i no longer want you to be my manager i'm gonna move out on my own and do da 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 that's exactly what happened I guarantee just doing shit just doing shit that's a different type of portrayal that's why she by herself now but i'm not speaking on nobody's behalf i don't wish no harm to nobody way i really just want y'all to just pray on this situation if y'all even even give a fuck about it I'm just venting on live because it's lit on this bitch. Two, what did you learn from the relationship with Blue? Um, her brother's so tired of her talking about that shit. He said, stop dropping the low. Get off live. <laughs> Not a goddamn thing. People, people, I'm trying to think. People, you can't, you can't, you can't put a person so close to your heart where you put God at. So you will trust a motherfucker and love a motherfucker so hard how you will love something that that's meaningful to love and it can be very detrimental. See, he should have been getting 20%. She should have been getting 80 because she's the one performing. If anything, he definitely should have got a cut, you know, because of the dynamic of the situation but as a man he couldn't deal with that so i guarantee he was giving her 20 percent. but do y'all remember when whack um somebody was like does does blue face get paid from krishan and whack was like yeah i got him set up pretty nice oh he getting paid i got him set up real nice that shit fucked up financially physically mentally emotionally all that like it's like it's like you have to know who to trust or how to trust them and have boundaries. Like, see, with me, we'll put boundaries down. And if even one of us go left, like, this is how I feel in the relationship with me and Blueface. We have boundaries. And he'll be like, yeah, but I don't want you doing this and I don't want you doing that. And I'm like, well, you do this and you do that. That's that double standard shit. It's not fair. I'm going to do whatever. So since I said I'm going to do whatever, I'm going to get the short end of the stick. And I, I didn't fuck with that. I didn't, just, like, just because I'm not letting you, like, you know. Walk all over me. Yeah. Control me. Like, I, I, I let you do a lot, but it ain't going to go that far. Like, it went further enough, but it ain't going to go that far. So, 
I don't know, he's trying to teach me a lesson. He wasn't teaching me shit. What I learned from this, I'm trying to think, what I learned from this relationship is don't call it a relationship. Like, this ain't no relationship. You know what a relationship is? Rela a relationship is actually good. Boy, shut the fuck up. We charges. He was my friend. We just My and I say he never cheated on me only because we was never together. Like we was already outside. We was never really together. You know what I'm saying? But she still couldn't do what she wanted to do because he he go crazy. I bet he ain't that thinking about Krishan right now. That's why he can't get with me like that because I, 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 when, when he, go, when he do him, it's not, oh, he's just doing him, he a man. No, we just not together. Yeah, I be fucking blue, blue, but we ain't together. He be fucking on whatever he be fucking on. That's on, up to him and him. Like, you hear me? So I hate one fuck, like, oh yeah, this blue face girlfriend. Y'all know the definition of girlfriend? Girlfriend is not even in the Bible. Like, Krishan, you was the one acting like that nigga was your man. Those things these girlfriends always turned it on up. They just your friends, real shit. Yeah, I'm telling you. When I first met Blue, we were good friends. We were great friends. We was fucking, but nothing was complicated. Me, I'm very territorial, so if I'm For fucking sure. on you, you're mine regardless. So if it's not gonna work out that way, it just never was gonna work out in the first place. He was actually thinking, let me get the video with him real quick. That's cool, let me. Um, hold up, hold on, I gotta go. I call that back. <laughs> she give me calling us back. All right, y'all, I'm gonna react to that other live y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below um i wouldn't go get his ass out not at all you know what i'm saying uh, who <laughs> uh but anyway yeah would y'all let me know um love y'all appreciate y'all yeah yeah